Yo, what is up, guys? I am back with another Universal Tower Defense video. And in this video, I'll be showcasing 2B's Universal Tower Defense macro by Faxi. This is a Faxi macro. If you know a little bit about Faxi and if you use it a little, it used to create a lot of anime adventures macro. 2B is one of the developers in Faxi which have which had created the anime fan cards macro and has recently created this UTD macro. And this, I'm gonna show you how I macro in Universal Tower Defense. And that's why I got semi-stacked units and 157,000 gems as well. And we can look at the virtual shop. I do have quite a decent amount of cards. Not not the not the craziest amount, but you know pretty good amount and I did buy all the trade reroes that you can buy as well so that's pretty nice I got myself a ruler scarlet maid I don't think ruler is good on her but hey you gotta make best of what you get all right so the units I'm, I'll be using is ruler Sun Jin Wu. I don't think you need Sun Jin Wu for this ace ruler is actually not used in this macro but it's just here so I can use it for auto challenge I got astro Kirito now you don't even need e6 for this because astro Kirito is probably all you need speed wagon a confused unit and lastly miku as well so this part of the video is on how you can set it up really easily right here all right you just want to search up virtual realm or vr or right, you should find a little all right since they're pretty easy to make or pretty easy to complete there isn't many at the moment all right but i did create a marine fortress but all you gotta do is you're gonna check the pins and you want to download basically config the config should usually be named act one or a map name Right, so once you download it, you're just gonna let it chill here. I'm just gonna download it easily. Right now, if you do see presets, you wanna download them too, and I'll show you how you can set them up. Right, once you are done with it, you wanna go to your macro folder. All right, so how you can import the presets is really easy. All right, you're just gonna copy these two right here. Or either you copy or you cut them, and you wanna go back to your macro folder, go to your settings, and go to your presets. It's really easily since i already have them i can just replace them all right and that is it okay now lastly you want to do the same thing for your config here as well we call them configs you can call them teams you can call them macros or whatever but we're going to import this all right so you i'm just going to copy this and i'm going to put it in my macro folder right here we should find a folder called virtual realm and you want to go to your marine base or whatever map you downloaded for and you want to paste it in since i already have act one i'm just going to replace it all right lastly i'm just going to open my macro right now all right so we do have our macro right here now i'll show you another way you can import your configs if you don't want to import it by that way really easily i'll just choose the map that i want i'll choose marine base and i'll set it to amount of dif difficulty meter if i want to I'll go to my unit config page, I'll press the top left button, I'll go to my downloads and I'll just click on act 1. It will basically import it here and I'll just save settings. Alright, in this case I'm just going to do 100% since I just don't want to stress myself and that's it, we are basically done. Alright, now you do need to choose your select path, I'm going to choose magician since Kirito is good with magician and I'm going to choose my cards as you can see here I already chosen mine. Alright, we have every single card there is and the amount of categories and the category priority here as well all right that is basically it all right you can swap easily this is the ones i use you can copy this if you want or you can go to my thread right here and you can just copy it and paste it in the macro settings all right lastly once we are done i'm just gonna f1 now you can also do auto challenges with this or half hourly challenge it has all three challenges as well but if you don't want to do that for this sake i'm just gonna run this without half hourly challenge so let's start the macro also you can see the cpu percentage the memory it uses basically the macro performance stats anyways i'm gonna be right back
Well, as you can see, it works pretty great. So honestly, this macro is pretty chill. Be able to get your average tolerance. You can check your compatibility as well. You can change different themes to different colors. I do like blue because well, it's pretty blue. Uh, if that makes sense. But yeah, you can do a lot of customization. Right with your unit configs, placement condition, target priority. Yeah, so you can do so many more. And it's really customizable as well. Alright, I didn't run half hourly challenges, but in my other video I did showcase them. So you can go check it out. So anyways, do like to subscribe. If you want to cop a macro at a really cheap price right now, which is like 480, go ahead. Alright, the links are in the description below. Do like and subscribe and I'll see you guys really really soon.